Now, Just wait for the ad to be over. Hey, Josh Lucas, man. I tell you what. So special thanks to Cat Trumpet <laughs> for providing today's fire for our fireside chat. We had to suspend the fireside chat because of the wind, and also I burned off half my beard. Definitely don't have footage of that. It's... You can't even tell, sadly. And that's the reason you should have a nice big beard. All right, so. We are picking up on our European trip here. Um, we gotta get all this out. Everybody needs to know what happened in Europe. <laughs> we get to Nice and it's pouring rain. Pouring. We're, we're no stranger to it. We know how to navigate the weather. I do anyway. I grew up with the weather. This girl. <laughs> Luckily, our... we had rain jackets and we. You just, mean somebody was prepared? We just rocked it, you know? I was in sandals like always. <laughs> it's pouring rain. What do you do when it's pouring rain in Nice? We rain? went to the beach. <laughs> You, uh, you go to the beach. <laughs> Are you dry? You're already wet. You're already wet? Oh, man. So as we made our way to the chateau, this short little hike up on the hill, we stumbled upon this outdoor marketplace and it was just really cute. Look at how cute this place is. Oh Say bonjour. <laughs> okay, the chateau was awesome. <laughs> we hike up a hill, big flight of stairs. Um, there's Life like, made it the entire way. Of course walking. you did. The, the yeah. guy at this point is unstoppable. What a We get up to the top, it's this beautiful waterfall, and then there's something that the kids spot, of course. Every time we turn a corner, I feel like in Nice, there was a park, and they were so excited. So mm -hmm. we hit, I don't know, 10 parks. All the big there. parks. <laughs> So day two, we went to, we walked around town a little bit and we went to, we stumbled upon this live fountain situation. What is it? What would it be called? Live fountain. <laughs> Sounds it like was just this something like something out of a fairy tale play, like water play area for kids, but it was like fancy and amazing. And it was a bunch of holes in the ground, literally surrounded by palaces and chateaus. It was just really cool. So, good job, nice <laughs> friends. You guys are nice. <laughs> I go, we got this, it's gonna be so Yeah.
So then after that, we carried on to this monastery. It was like gung ho about going to this monastery. Because on the it hill. was a it was a vision quest. <laughs> we needed to find our destiny. So how did we get there? We hiked. And then we hiked some more. <laughs> and then after that we kind of I think we actually we hiked a little bit more. <laughs> the monastery had gorgeous gardens throughout. Are you using different words? Roses. Oh. <laughs> the whole thing. So we explored for a little bit. And then the kids stumbled upon another park. Oh. I can't be happier than I am right now. Than I am right now. I can't be happier than I am right now. Than I am right now. How spiky those things are. Yeah, if you hold on. Hey. Did it pop like right you? Let's go to that park. We're gonna go to that park? Yeah. Actually, it is two parks. There was one, three, five, six, oh, nine, nine, two. What? We got sunshine. We got sunshine. What? Are you for On a trip like this with different expectations across the board you have to manage it so everybody needs to get a little something so i think at this point we were doing a lot better with that we were taking short breaks here and there for them doing five to ten minute park breaks throughout the day and it just seemed to flow better much yeah. better well we're, we're starting to get the rhythm a little bit now we're what a week and a half into the trip mm -hmm. of a like four and a half week trip so we started to kind of find our you know, how we were going to do things and just uh, the rhythm. I like that word. Rhythm. rhythm. The rhythm of the night. Yes. <laughs> that's going in the video. It's crazy. Uh, you guys, that's an exclusive sneak peek. <laughs> we should do an album. Let's stack a bunch of stuff, but not finish any of them. We are totally off topic right now. So when we were up at the chateau, we looked down into this harbor and we thought, hey, we should go there too. This is a rhythm. This was kind of a turning point for me, really. Why? I don't know, man. Just something about that city. Bonsoir, monsieur. When you get greeted like that, it just <laughs> it does something to you. Bonsoir, The monsieur. way that they talk is very... I'm like, I'm married. Stop flirting with me. I just feel like they're very sophisticated and like it's just like another level. Monsieur? <laughs> Moi? I mean, yeah. So that was our France. So that was France. Yeah. Europe Adventure, part quattro. Miss you guys, love you guys. Um, man, we are getting anxious to hug and kiss some people. Because I have hugged and kissed all the people in our little germ pool to their heart's extent. True story. So they are tired of being hugged and kissed. I need some strangers to love on. You could be the one. Follow. Next time. Subscribe, hit the bell. <laughs> Get alerts whenever this thing goes live. We'll see you next week. Next video. We'll see you next video. Be ready. Um, we're going to talk about Italy. Italy. Yeah, we'll try and get that to you ASAP so we can get on to the bus. Italy was amazing. What isn't amazing? All right, peace. This video better than other stuff. I'm going to flip out. <laughs>